Hey guys, welcome to a quick tutorial video here. I've had a few messages from people asking me to do a tutorial video um, on how to set up Terra Firmacraft. It's a little bit more complicated than, than most of the mods out there. Um, so I've decided to make this uh, this video. It shouldn't be more than a couple of minutes really. Um, all the links that you need will be in the description below. Um, but one thing to bear in mind before you start is that you need... This only works. The current recommended build is for Minecraft 1.2.5. So um, you need that version to get this to work. Now because I don't like uh, these mods interfering with my regular Minecraft client, I install it into a separate folder onto my desktop, um, which you know you, you can do as well. You can see I've got a folder here called Terraformer, and this is where all these files are stored and I, I've written a little start script etc to run it. Um, and what I will do at the end of this video, as well as giving you a tutorial on how to install it manually, um, I will just link a download to my whole Terra Firmacraft setup, my folder, so that you can just download it, stick it on your desktop, and off you go, basically, uh, if that's what you're, if that's what you want. So let's get started. Um, as I've mentioned, I've got a regular Minecraft installation here, 1.2.5. Obviously you've got to choose not to update, otherwise you won't be able to use this. But it's just regular Minecraft, Minecraft 1.2.5, there's no mods installed on this at the moment. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go into the .minecraft folder, into your bin folder, open up minecraft.jar with WinRAR, delete the meta-inf folder, and then you're going to need to download these four sets of files. Again, links will be in the description. I'm going to extract them all here to folders, just to make my life a little bit easier and um, it's quite important that you install them in this order as well it's especially when it comes to Minecraft Forge and Player API if you put them in the wrong way it can break things so the first thing you want to install is Minecraft Forge um, and it's literally you just open up the folder you do control A to select all the files and drag them into WinRAR and we're gonna do the same with Player API but what I like to do because there's quite a few uh, additions to this mod of quite a few different um, modifications or plugins. Um, I like to just test it in between each one just to make sure it's working. Um, and as you can see, that went fine. It says one mod loaded. If we click mod, um, we've just got Minecraft Forge and Mod Loader, which is fine. So that one's fine. So now we can go ahead and put our player API on. Exactly the same process. I like to delete uh, some of these, these irrelevant text files. Um, I'm not sure if it matters, but I do delete those. So that's installed. Let's just test that again. No for the update. And there we go. All installed. No errors. We're good to go. So last thing then is to actually install the TerraFirmaCraft itself, so that's the two folders that we have here, I'll delete those. Uh, you want to put in the client core first, I don't really think it matters but that's what we're going to do. Drag them all in there, we're going to put both of these in at the same time, hopefully we won't have any problems. And that should be it, that should be TerraFirmaCraft installed guys. So let's just uh, fire it up, we'll make a new world and we'll test it. And if we click mods, you can see that uh, Terra Firmacraft is there. And if we go to single player, uh, let's delete that world. These are my uh, existing worlds. I'll just call it whatever. And we should, as long as we don't spawn in the jungle, we should see the uh, Terra Firmacraft textures. And there we are, with the stones. And we can destroy stuff. And we should get the stone there it is granite rock and this is the latest version of terra firma craft so that's it guys so if you want to do it manually it's really simple it only takes five minutes links are in the description um, if you don't want to do it manually i will put up my whole terra firma folder minus my saves obviously uh, just to make it smaller uh, up for download so you can just download that whole thing stick it on your desktop and you're done uh, but thank you for watching guys hope you enjoyed speak to you soon Thank <laughs> you.